Uh, this body, Excellency, is the highest organ of governance of the Dangote Group of Companies, uh, which comprises of Dangote Industries Limited and its subsidiaries. While each of the subsidiary companies has its own board of directors as required by law, the DIL board provides overall leadership and strategic direction for the entire group. The Dangote Industries Limited Board is also responsible for setting overall targets and goals for the group and makes key resource allocations uh, decisions. Your Excellency, uh, the, purpose, uh, the primary purpose of our visit is to enable the board to express its profound appreciation to Your Excellency for the great honor you have done to the Dangote Group when you personally commissioned the new 3 million tons uh, fertilizer plant, uh, which is our latest subsidiary in the group called Dangote Fertilizer Limited last month. We also seized the opportunity to reiterate our immense gratitude for the sustained efforts of your administration, uh, administration through various policy initiatives aimed at progressively improving the business environment and investment climate. Despite some unprecedented challenges, our economy has been confronted with over the past decade. We are also deeply grateful for your direct interventions at various times when our operations were challenged by some unintended consequences of economic policy positions. Your interventions have not only helped to resolve business challenges, but have been a source of great encouragement in our determination to continue to invest in our economy for the benefit of our country and our people. Uh, permit me, Your Excellency, to give you a brief highlight of the scope and impact of our group's various businesses. The group comprises uh, the Dangote Industries Limited, a private limited liability company, and several subsidiary companies operating in diverse sectors of the Nigerian economy as well as other economies in Africa. Today, the Dangote Group is the most diversified conglomerate in Nigeria and in Africa. Our flagship uh, subsidiary company is the Dangote Cement PLC, which today is the largest enterprise listed on the Nigerian exchange. Dangote Cement uh, 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 operates four integrated plants in Nigeria with a total of 35 million metric tons of cement per annum, which accounts to over 60% of the Nigerian cement uh, production and ensures self-sufficiency in cement in Nigeria. Uh, Dongote Cement uh, PLC is also present in 14 other African countries and uh, you know, we operate uh, integrated plants in 10 countries out of uh, over 50 million metric tons, making it one of the top 10 cement manufacturing uh, companies in the world. Uh, Your Excellency, as you are aware, our own sugar business, which we have, comprising of, uh, comprises of uh, sugar refinery in Apapa in Lagos, 1.4 million tons of white sugar and also industrial grade sugar. We also operate an integrated sugar plant from cane to refined sugar in Numan Adama state with a sugar cane plantation of about 10,000 hectares and plan to develop the full 32,000 uh, hectares available. Following your Excellency's policy initiatives under uh, the Nigerian Sugar Master Plan, and encouraged by the active support of the Nigerian Sugar Council. We, all, we are also developing a new integrated sugar plant in Nasara State involving about 60,000 hectares of cane plantations. Sir. Your Excellency, you are, also, uh, you are already uh, familiar with the 3 million tons urea and ammonia plant, so I will not really dwell on this new subsidiary. Uh, you know, this was done by you commission uh, just last month. And this is actually, uh, you know, uh, was motivated and enabled by your government's clear vision and strong support for a renewed policy focus on agriculture aimed at achieving food self-sufficiency. 
Another important investment made by this board, which was motivated and stimulated by your visionary leadership, is our investment in Dongote Rice Limited, which has recently acquired 10 large-scale rice milling plants with a total capacity uh, of 1.2 million uh, tons of paddy rice. The mills are being established in six states of the Federation, including KB, Sokoto, Zampara, Jigawa, Niger, and Kano states. Two of these mills, Jigawa and Sokoto, are expected to start operating uh, by the end of this year. They are, in uh, they are intended to source paddy rice from the local farmers through an outgrower scheme in which Dangote Rice Limited provides quality inputs, including seeds, fertilizer, agrochemicals, and extension services, with a guarantee to buy uh, uh, the uh, paddy rice from the farmers. To support our outgrowers, we have established an agro services center uh, in Kasena State for seed multiplication and soil testing services, as well as training of extension services uh, personnel. Your Excellency, you are already familiar with our oil uh, refinery and the petrochemical project, which is set to transform the Nigerian economy. As I promised Your Excellency, during your brief site visit to this world-class oil refinery, this board looks forward to your return visit to the Dongote Free Zone to commission the complex before the end of your turn up by the grace of God. Your Excellency, our board is immensely proud of the contributions of our diversified operations to our economy and the well-being of our people. We are happy and grateful to the Almighty for granting us the opportunity to impact our economy, to impact our economy and the lives of our people in many positive ways. Through the output of our various businesses, our group is proud to be making significant contributions to the diversification and growth of our own economy. And I'm sure Your Excellency are fully aware that uh, in terms of employment, our own group is actually is second only to the federal government of Nigeria in terms of size of its workforce. And we are still growing in the agriculture and oil and gas sectors. Through the various taxes, levies, and fees, and other remittances, we make to both national and sub-national governments as well as similar uh, payments made by our various business partners and employees. Our contributions to the government revenues are indeed very substantial, sir. Your Excellency, all these investments are driven by our corporate vision to become the leading provider of our people's essential needs in food, shelter, and energy services. Our belief is that our country has the potential to be a strong industrial nation capable of not only of meeting its basic needs of our citizens, but making significant contributions to Africa's economic transformation. We firmly believe that Nigeria will be the powerhouse of the continent's inclusive and sustainable economic development through industrialization and strategic diversification. Despite the unprecedented challenges we have faced, especially over the first five years, we are strongly committed to the pursuit of our vision. We will continue not only to expand our investments in the businesses we are currently involved in, but we will explore and invest in new sectors and sectors and subsectors of the strategic importance to our nation and our continent's economic growth and development trajectory. In pursuit of our vision uh, over the first seven years, Your Excellency's unequivocal commitment to the creation of an inclusive, diversified, and resilient economy based on the promotion of domestic productive capacity has been a source of great strength and encouragement. Your insistence that our economic policy stance must aim to enable us to produce what we consume and consume what we produce is a call to action to which the Dangote Group fully subscribes. Let me end this address by reiterating our board's profound gratitude and deep appreciation of Your Excellency's immense support and encouragement. Finally, let me commend Your Excellency for your unwavering focus on redirecting our economy towards internally driven growth 
and self-sufficiency in what has been a period of unprecedented challenges and global turbulence. Thank you very much, Your Excellency. Chairman and Board Directors, Dangote Industry, Industries Limited, come the Chairman and members of the Board of, of Directors of Dangote Industry Limited. I recall with great pleasure my visit to the Dangote Free Trade Zone just about four weeks ago to commission the group's new 3 million metric ton fertilizer plant. Let me once again congratulate you and your board for a very successful commissioning ceremony. As I said at that event, the coming on stream of this plant was a huge opportunity to ramp up the productivity of our agricultural sector. It is therefore a most welcome booster to our government strategy for achieving food security and reducing poverty. Given recent developments globally, especially the effect of the ongoing war in Europe on worldwide food supply chain, I must commend your foresight for bringing the plant into operation at the time you did. I know it was that market realities will bring pressure to bear on Angote Fertilizer Limited to seek to meet the demands of your export customers. However, given your group's well-known patriotic vision, I am confident that your board will continue to accord priority to meet local demands of our farmers. I note the scope and scale of the Dangote Group business empire and its positive impact on the Nigerian economy and the economies of several African countries. It is gratifying to note your board's commitment not only to continue to grow your existing investment to scale up wealth creation, employment generation and poverty reduction, but also to seek new investment opportunities to help the over the diversification of our economy. I want to assure you, however, that the government will do everything possible to enhance development in infrastructure, especially in energy and transportation sectors. We will also continue to implement needed reforms in the public service to significantly improve the ease of doing business. Mr. Chairman, I must officially commend you and your board for the development of the Dangote Refinery and Petrochemical Complex. I had a good view of this incredible city of steel and concrete when my helicopter circled over it during my visit to the commissioning of the fertilizer plant. Mr. Chairman, let me again thank you and you are bored for the courage and foresight that enabled you to embark on these mega investment projects which will have enduring benefit to generations of Nigerians. Entrepreneurs such as Alhaji Ali Kodangote are unique gifts to their societies and the institutions they build, and they often become the pillars of stable, enduring, prosperous economies. I therefore urge other Nigerians in the business sector to emulate this iconic entrepreneur by investing in such enterprises that will in time become worthy legacies as national assets which will continue to benefit their people for generations to come. Mr. Chairman, I thank you and your board members for this courtesy visit. God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria.